Welcome back. New at 11. Optimism in the Florida Keys. Despite so much damage, business owners moving fast to try to welcome tourists back. And today was the first day since Hurricane Irma that most of the Keys were open to everybody. And while we're likely weeks away from a full-fledged tourism push, CBS 4 News has learned Monroe County leaders are hoping tourists give them about another week or so and then head on down to start pumping life back into the Keys economy. CBS 4's Hank Tester has more from Key Largo. But this is the main area that got damaged from the roof, and the rest of this was all underwater. So it's going to be a while. It's going to be a little, a little bit. The interior of the shipwreck bar and grill, one of Key Largo's legendary watering holes and tourist attractions, trashed by Irma, scrambling to get back in business. The question is, are the upper keys ready for tourists? Come on down. Yeah, we're all back up and running and ready to go. We encourage people to come down. Um, we definitely need it back. That's not unexpected. Tourism drives the Keys economy, cash flow critical. But what kind of tourism experience will it be? Some of the restaurants are open, but they're offering limited menus. And the hotels are, I think a lot of them are housing emergency responders. Mm -hmm. So I think it's going to be a while before the, the Keys are ready for tourists. The further down the Keys, the more challenges, especially east of Key West, where Irma struck first. Key West gearing up, power back to 76% in the lower Keys. Northern Keys, almost 98% power restoration. I know. I I know. Know. I know. Getting back to business at Key Largo's Denny's Latin Cafe. Roof being repaired, this from the owner. Most of the businesses are opening up now, so I always say starting Monday, we should be limited, but ready to go. Dive boats are ready. Dan Dawson's been through this hurricane drill before. He knows the deal. In about three weeks after, we'll start seeing the trickle of people starting to come back in. So a visit right now won't exactly be the Keys tourism experience you're used to. But if you do come down, those who have their business open will certainly appreciate it. That's the very latest. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News Tonight.